Pursuant to House Resolution 746, the gentleman from Michigan, Mr. Schauer, and a member of the House will each control five minutes. The Chair recognizes the gentleman from Michigan. Thank you, Madam Speaker. My amendment gives priority in awarding federal grants to schools, states, and nonprofits to encourage dislocated workers to complete their degrees. In the last two years, 6.5 million Americans have lost their jobs, and many of them remain dislocated workers. These individuals are in need of retraining in a new field that will help them transition in the new economy. And nowhere is, is this more true than in my home state of Michigan. I want to tell you about Ray Roddy in Hillsdale, Hillsdale, Michigan. His home county, by the way, has an unemployment rate of 20%. Mr. Roddy was laid off from his job making engine components and realized he would need further education to find another job. He enrolled at Jackson Community College and is working hard to become a nurse. Many, like Ray, need retraining to regain employment in a new field, but are unable to find it. Now, within the Access and Completion Innovation Fund, my amendment will give priority to degree completion something that matters to people like Ray Roddy. H.R. 3221 will make key investments in providing Americans with affordable and accessible education. My amendment will ensure that those who have been hurt the most in this tough economy, like Ray, aren't lost and are provided with opportunities for retraining to get back on their feet. Uh, I would now yield to Mr. Etheridge of North Carolina. For, for what period of time? Uh, for... Colloquy. Gentlemen's recognized.